हेलो फ्रेंड स्टूडेंट दिस ट्यूटोरियल वी विल बी बिल्डिंग दिस कोरोना वायरस एप्लीकेशन या कोविड चार्ट्स एप्लीकेशन वेयर वी विल बी डिस्प्लेइंग द वीकली एक्टिव केसेस हियर फॉर ईच ऑफ द कंट्रीज हियर सो यू विल सी दिस इज द ड्रॉप डाउन लिस्ट हियर यू कैन सेलेक्ट ईच ऑफ द कंट्री हियर इफ आई सेलेक्ट दिस कंट्री हियर यू विल सी द कंफर्म रिकवर्ड एंड नंबर ऑफ दिस केसेस डिस्प्लेड इन अ नाइसली मैनर इनसाइड द चार्ट हियर यू विल सी वी कैन सेलेक्ट एनी कंट्री ऑफ आवर चॉइस हियर and you can just zoom the chart here and see on the individual date how many cases are got recovered deaths here so you will see that all these this is a colorful chart so we are fetching all this information from a website called that uh, worldometer.com so you have seen this website you you can see if you just search on this website here worldometer so this is the website which contains the data for each of the countries in real time so we are fetching the data from this website and displaying it inside the application so you will see you can change the country accordingly and now you can see that this is the package that we are using so just go to npmjs.com and uh, you search ne you need to be searching for this dependency which is the covid chart so you can see that covid charts is there npmi covid charts dependency seven weekly downloads are there so you can see that seven weekly downloads are there you either you can also use it inside your nodejs application but also you can use it inside your uh, browser site as well you need this uh, cdn so simply include this cdn copy paste the cdn covid chart of country so you will see this this is the application we need a select box where we can select all the countries here so basically you can go to the video description link if you want the full source code i have given the link in the video description so this is my blog post which holds all the source code so just go to do it and download all the source code so i will be making use of it so you can see this is a select list here which contains all the countries here this is the countries here you will see all the countries are there we have has select box here we have given a id to it which is countries simply if you open with live server you will see all the countries are there this is the select box here you can select any country of your choice now basically the html is complete we need to write the javascript after including this dependency make a script tag and first of all what we need to do is that we need to get the reference of the select box so we will say countries document dot get element by id countries and here we will say countries dot add event listener so whenever the value changes this event will automatically trigger and here what we can do is that we can say we can print out the value which the user has selected whichever of the country here countries dot value so in the console so basically now if i refresh it in and right click inspect element in the console what you will find is that if i select any of the country this country will be printed out you will see algeria is printed out if i select armenia this will be printed out now what we want to do is that we need to simply print the covid chart of individual country which we have selected so this is very simple what we need to do is that we need to copy paste the code it is also there inside video disc, uh, documentation as well simply copy this code and paste this code here so simply i will format the document so you will see it is creating a chart here and here we need to change the location so after this select here we will give four break tags here 
after these four break tags we will have a div which will have the id of result to it inside this we will display it so we will say here instead of body we will say document dot get element by id and here this will be result and we will change the country to whatever country the user has selected which will be holding inside countries dot value and you can also change the width and the height of the COVID chart so I will change this to 500 to 500 so now if you refresh the application you will see if you change the country now it will display the COVID chart of that country if I change the country now you will see it will append this this is not what we want we want it to replace with the existing country so at the very top what we can do is that we can clear out the existing value so document dot get element by id result inner html will be equal to nothing so we are clearing out the previous entry so once again if you refresh it you will see if i select australia now you will see this is exactly what the, we want here so it is displaying all the confirmed recovered number of that's covid 19 cases for each of the countries we selected so you can see that guys it is now displaying it and uh, this is a browser example javascript example now i will show you how to use it inside your node.js application as well so you can create a simple node.js project at the very here npm init dash y and you can install this dependency which is uh, npm i covid charts So it would hardly take some time here. <coughs> so now it has successfully installed it. So we can now create the index.js for the node.js so this is the example code it has given to us so simply paste it so in this way you can use it inside your node.js application so thanks very much guys for watching this video